you guys are two and zero when I'm here. So. <laughs> you need to stick around. We'll put you. I'm gonna give you meal money too, by the way. All right. Um, I just wanted to ask you a little bit about the mentality of close games like that. You know, just all the way through. Uh, how do guys stick through those? Well, when you get situations where you don't score, you get guys in scoring position, third base, second base. You get the leadoff guy on, and, and you don't score. It's very easy to let down. And as a pitcher, you got to be twice as tough. You got to end up not letting that bother you. You got to go back out there and just do your job. And Johnny did that. He ended up keeping his mentality straight. Um, went out there and did his job. Worked ahead of the hitters. I thought he established his fastball and then worked his slider off of that, and they end up chasing. Uh, so he had a good formula where he worked ahead, and then he had good control on that slider where you know a couple pitches got away from him, maybe with two strikes, and gave up a single here and there, but not many at all. Did a good, did a really good job. Speaking of mental toughness, John, you tell me a little bit about uh, recovering from Tommy John surgery. Um, can you tell me a little bit about what kind of development you've seen over the last two years? Well, I think it was more, and it's tough to say if it was physical or mental development. Um, you know, when, when he um, got healthy after the surgery, um, control was an issue. And so was it because of the mental process of coming back or was it mechanics? Um, if I looked at it, I'd say mechanics, you know, and, and um, you can see a little bit better mechanics out of him when he's, uh, when he's on, when he's effective. Um, you can see differences in the arm action, you know, if, if it's not going well. But I think initially coming back, he had to learn to end up throwing all over again. You know, and I'm not a pit, I wasn't a pitcher, so I have never not gone through that. But I think in the back of your mind, you're probably thinking that something should hurt or, you know, is my, my arm, is, is it there where it's supposed to be? I think that's just an adjustment there that each individual has to go through. Did he pitch it all last season? Or? He did. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and that, you know, the issue with him has been consistency. It's been control. Um, he's got a live arm. His ball moves naturally. The issue has been with his off-speed stuff. Um, so what he's done, what, what he's been enabled, enabled to do this year is to end up establishing consistency in his breaking pitch. He's controlling his fastball. Still got life on it. But now he's able to end up offsetting that with a good off-speed pitch, and that's what's made him effective. He's stayed around the zone much more consistently. And what about that last inning, uh, Coach? You know, what kind yeah. of emotional roller coaster did you go well, through? Well, yeah, you know, and you feel good when you get the leadoff guy on, and then you start getting down. You know, we got down to the nine-hole hitter, and then we start turning the lineup over. So you, you're sitting there, and you still feel pretty good. Um, and again, Darius may not have hit the ball the hardest. He just put it in the right location. And it made the pitcher feel the ball, and, and we, we caught a break there uh, very easily. Could have been two outs there. We got our uh, leadoff guy on. I expected them probably to walk him to get to our two-hole guy. So we still had an opportunity after that if the pitcher makes the play. But it obviously it's good. You know, uh, walk-off is always good. First time we were a home team in the tournament. So no matter what happened before that, top of the inning, we were still going to come up last uh, with our at-bats in this game. Last time I talked to you, Coach, you, you mentioned that you wanted Today, obviously, uh, you didn't necessarily get that. Is that what you're looking forward to most tomorrow? Yeah, you know, yesterday, and I thought it was going to roll over. Yesterday, I thought we swung the bats a lot, very aggressively, and, and a lot better than, than we have. And I was expecting us to come out today and do the same thing. And, 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 and it, it, it's, it's no discredit to their pitcher. I think he did a great job. He stayed around the zone. He pitched effectively with his off-speed stuff. I'm not so sure that we approached it very well, though. I and mean, I think we can we can do a better job in that area. Um, but yeah, there's no question. You're going to get some decent pitching. You hope to get decent pitching. But eventually, you're going to end up having to score some runs for that guy. I can't hold the ship together all day. So I'd like to see these guys swing just a little bit more, more aggressively and consistently. And from the coach's standpoint, a lot earlier in the game, too, it would be very helpful. All right, coach, do you have anything?